Right, now with that sheep there, please sheepy boy, please do not get seen. Wait a minute! Where did the sheep go? Hello and welcome back to Vvoid, I'm Steve and this is Sheep, Dog and Wolf. Rice, okay. God damn it, press the wrong button. I think I know what I've got to do. But I did say at the end of the last episode that there was something I wanted to quickly try. Uh, get away! Okay. See if I can actually race this guy. What is the benefit of doing this? So he's there now. Is that good? I'll level with you. I might as well say while I'm waiting for this train. I'm assuming what I can do is getting this boulder to where Sam is. Getting it onto the seesaw. But if I am right with that assumption... I'm going to have to try using the disguise again. Now, he was fairly close to me, so maybe there is a bit of a delay before he actually grabs me. All I can do is just see what happens. And come on, push it off. Because I think what's interesting is the fact that you get a fairly decent amount of time. So I'm just going to try a theory. Just going to try a theory and hopefully I don't die because if I die, I'm going to have to do all that again. I don't like that. <sighs> no, he just runs to me. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, so look away, Mace. Hold up. So why is it sometimes he runs directly for me? What kind of bullshit is this? Seriously, why is it there are times he runs directly at me, but then there's times he just walks towards me? That makes no sense. So that's why he was walking towards me, because he's grabbing the sheep. Good to know. <laughs> I tricked you. Why? I'm sorry, but that is so random. If there's a pattern there, I'm not fucking seeing it. Okay. So the amount of times that I have tried to get the sheep's attention, now I've got another idea. Which is... Get his attention. Come on. Get his attention. Come on. Get his attention. It's ten seconds. The train is going to stop any minute now. Okay, the idea is to get his attention while the train is on the other side. Well, while Sam is on the other side of the train, I run round and then grab the sheep. Jesus fucking Christ. You just had to just not follow me now all of a sudden. Okay, that train should stop. Okay, come on. No, come on. Get get out get off the thing. Get off the thing. I've only got 40 odd seconds. That this might be the reason why Son of a fucking This might be the reason why 
there's only 40 seconds there. Twenty seconds, that's cool. Carry no, come on. Eighteen seconds, come on. Right, okay. The sheep is here. Right, so if any luck. Oh, he's gonna be guarding that now. Okay, okay. Right. Let's get the boulder so I can throw the sheep over. And hopefully he doesn't see the sheep when it's over there. Right, now with that sheep there, please, sheepy boy, please do not get seen. Wait a minute! Where did the sheep go? Right, okay. So that was a bit of a ball ache. Turns out, if the train stops up there, the sheep jumps off the train. Now oh, pick up the fucking thing. Okay, okay. Just gotta wind it up a bit more. That's not a problem. Look, it is a problem when a fucking thing doesn't pop up. Right, see what it's like halfway. Because I'd imagine I'm gonna have to be quick with this one. Interesting. Cool. God damn it, sheepy boy! You know what? I'm playing it safe. I'm throwing another one. No, I'm not, apparently. You're not going to go for that button, are you? Oh, he's just not going to jump off it. Okay, fair enough. He's going to try to, though. Right. Right. That might have either reset the animation or the timer for that thing is longer than I thought. In that case, I'm just going to I'm just going to risk it. I'm just going to risk it. I'm just going to risk it. Right, come on, end the animation, thank you. Are we done? Right, I think we're done. Okay, loading screen, fair enough. There's still one missing. You are an exceptional contestant. Unfortunately, our show is nearly over. Thanks to all my fans out there for staying with us through to the end. See you soon. What's this? What's Marvin the Martian doing here? This wasn't in the script. There's the mission sheep. Oh, hang on, no! That insignificant little earthling! It looks like that ridiculous creature reached my planet because of a blunder you made, is that right? Hmm? Well, let me tell you how your friend got here. 
I was just getting ready to test my latest weapon, the PR-200, a very practical tool which reduces any living species to one-tenth of its normal size. For the experiment, I enlisted the help of a devoted member of my army. I was just about ready to test my invention, when suddenly, an invader smashed into my water tank at full speed, and the whole tank collapsed all over my army. The accursed invader looked like a black sheep. It was utter chaos, but after a super Martian effort and the help of my fantastic PR-200, I managed to get back most of my army. Isn't that delightful? Wait, I haven't finished yet! My army is still incomplete. A somewhat rebellious unit has gotten themselves into a sticky situation, and it's risky to get them out. I, Marvin the Martian, don't plan on taking any unnecessary risks. It's up to you to repair the damage now, by returning to me my lost instant Martians. Come, canine! Sit, boy! So there is an additional level. There we go, finally. To capture my instant Martians, you'll have to use this vacuum compressor. When an instant Martian comes anywhere near it, activate the compressor with your remote control. The instant Martian will be compressed and sucked in, then sent to me through this pipe. Won't that be lovely? Eh. Uh. <laughs> I don't give a flying fuck, mate. I really don't. Okay, okay, so are you going to be hostile? No, you're just going to run away. Okay. Okay, so put that down there. What did he actually say? I should have paid attention. I must have all of my instant Martians. Well, you're not really helpful, mate. I really should have paid attention. You know what? Let's actually read up about this stuff. Okay. Instant minion vacuum cleaner sucks up all all instant minions within a one meter radius. It works only when plugged into a ground connector. Right. Okay. And what's this thing, would you get? To activate the instant clean. Oh, right, okay. So I've got to put this thing here. Right. And to activate it, I now just get you to run into it. It's as simple as that. Interesting. Okay. Put you away. How am I doing for time? Yeah, I'm going to wrap up this video. Yeah, say how it is. That last episode, um, if this episode's shorter, that last level, that last level with all that waiting around, it really did throw me off. So hopefully this level, this episode isn't too short, but either ways, hopefully you enjoyed this video. And if you have, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Like and subscribe.